Yo, what is good, YouTubes? It's your boy, Ray, and this is the Everyday City Carry. I have an unboxing from the Apex Pass Around Group. No idea what's in here. This video is brought to you by the Beautiful Leather Goods by Andar. All products are 100% full grain leather. Orders over 35 bucks get free shipping automatically. You get free exchanges and a 90 day return policy. Maybe you want to pick up the Apollo. Or if you're like me and you want to go super minimal and slim, you'll probably check out the Monarch. And our wallets have this cool unique pull tab. They go like this, getting your cards out, that allows quick access to your cards. Head over to andar.com and use promo code EDCC to get 15% off your entire order. So let us get right into it. We have got this view again. I'm squirming around in the chair trying to figure it out. Shout out to the Akatsuki. I'm gonna be using the Migoron Knives Valona. I almost forgot the name for a second. This is a very interesting knife company that I found out because of uh, Backpack V. He sent it to me and um, I really like it, man. He sent me the Opry, which is the other knife that I used before and I just really like this. My bad if I'm a little bit low energy. Uh, this is my second day waking up at 4 a.m. with only like four or five hours of sleep. So, pardon your boy, dude. All right, so let's open it. Sometimes you need extra. There you go. Jesus, what the hell? That thing was, oh shit, there's another one. What the? What do we do with this? What? Oh, this is the Oni XL, I think. Well, let's take a look at this now then. I believe this is the Oni XL. I called the Jin the Oni, and I kept saying Oni in the video, and Damn Designs was like, nah, that's the Jin. This is the Oni though. I think the one with um, this like funky blade shape. Ta Tanto-esque, I would say, right? And this is a full tie one. Let me take a look. S35VN, it says. Uh, I don't know if you could see that. And there's some bit of a... This thing needs a wipe a little bit. But um, you've got this as a fl front flipper. Check that out. I like the sound that that makes. That's pretty cool. Ooh. There's your tie pocket clip right there, I'm assuming. I do not have a magnet right now, I'm just assuming that. And titanium scales from what it looks like here. Check for weight reduction. There is weight reduction in it. I am not sure if you'll be able to see that, but there is on the inside. Frame lock. You also have the option of opening this knife with the little, I don't even know what we call these now. It's not a spidey hole, because it's not a Spyderco. Fucking flick hole. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you guys know what I'm talking about. Uh, you got some nice rampage up here. I like the aesthetics of the blade myself. I like chunky, stubby folders. Because this makes me feel like I have something substantial and it's still within the legal limits of New York City, which is very gray and unclear. Uh, but since this is within the palm, you know what I'm saying? Like I feel like I'm more good to go than carrying something like this. You know what I mean? Is this a New York? A New York frame of mind. No, I'm just playing. All right, so let us use the Oni. I would have flashed the specs on the screen already. That's why I'm not, I don't talk about specs too much on here. Um, you have a titanium back, uh, backspacer as well. Forgot to mention that. Uh, this is only in, an unboxing for people that want to talk shit and say like, how come I don't know the specs? Hey man. Don't watch this then. Go watch Metal Complex or something. This is Knife Entertainment, baby! Alright, so we're gonna open this up right here. I don't know why this one wasn't in a package. I mean, wasn't in a uh, box or... This was just like not as packed as the other one, which is kind of strange to me. Ah, this is a Wii knife. Okay, cool. What do we do with this? Drop that down there, boy. Uh, this is the... The Wii Knife Miscreant, interesting. And it seems I have the black tie, black tie handle with satin finished holes. <laughs> that sounds so funny. Satin finished holes, that's gonna be the name of my strip club. 
Uh, you get your typical Wii knife, um, warranty card thingamajig, Wii knife wiping cloth, and your typical pouch that looks like this with that nice fuzzy walled interior. This is the Miscreant. So this is one of those knives that to me, I thought this was gonna be a lot bigger. And uh, this seems to be my speed, guys. So you've got a bunch of lightning pockets all over the scales here. Even the, um, the pocket clip has it. Let me get up close on that. And you got an extremely deep carry. Um, there is no cutout for it into the titanium, but it is recessed screws. Hopefully you guys can see that. This is a flipper and it is a very thin knife, like very thin in profile. Just look at that. It's a flipper. Here's your flipper right there, guys. God, this is my style of knife. Man, lately there have been some stuff coming through this channel that are just my speed. Again, another knife that I would feel comfortable carrying in my city. Drop shot is decent, it's okay. There's too many shakes on this, you see? You see that? This is a good drop shot right here, although this blade is like a lot heavier. You see that? This, I gotta force that shit, so you gotta do one of these. It's cool, I like doing that sometimes. Um, I do like how the holes have like this shimmer. Um, this is black coated, this is not the inside. That's kind of a nice touch. I think, I wanna say this is a Brad Zinker. Yep, there's your Brad Zinker logo right there. Very interesting knife though. The specs would have been flashed on the screen already. Man, there are like some rust spots on this. Is that like dirt or something? Oh, it is, it's just dirt. Okay, I'll clean that up later. Um, but yeah, this is fucking cool, man. I am going to love if I win this in the raffle. <laughs> So the Apex Fast Around group does raffle off knives sometimes, and I've definitely won some really cool ones, but nothing like a heavy hitter like this. Uh, I think the coolest thing I won one time was a Spyderco Shaman, which I sold later. It was too big for me, but it was a cool knife. But anyway, let's get back to this one, the Miscreant. So who is this for? Like office dwellers that want to go a little bit tack? This is like a gentleman's folder that looks a little bit tactical. I'm sure people probably talk shit about it like that. Because who is this knife really for? It's fucking for me, dude. An urban uh, carry type gentleman who lives in the city and wants something that looks super dope and fresh like this and doesn't necessarily want like a plain Jane simple titanium folder. Um, this is really cool to me. I'm gonna give this one a pass already and uh, definitely expect some content on these guys. So here we go. Let's show the two knives side by side again. The top is the Wii Knife Miscreant designed by Brad Zinker and the bottom is the Dam Designs Oni. Let me give you a close up of the blades here. Uh, still got some package on the Oni. I like this man. I like these two. This is your boy in the NYC. It's me Ray and this is the EDCC saying peace. Yo, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell icon so we can squat up in the comments.